That is how you beat the peg game every single time. Okay, I just got back from Cracker Barrel. I bought this old-fashioned peg game, and I think I have it figured out. Okay, so I do know this much. You need to start with this little hole here, okay, being open. This is how you beat the game every single time. So here we go. Let's clear out the front first, okay? So we're going to move this peg here and take this one. And then we're going to move this peg here and take this guy, okay? And now we're gonna take this peg here and put it there and take this guy. Okay, so we've cleared out the front. Okay, now we want to work on the sides. Okay, so we're gonna take this guy here and we're gonna put him here and take out this peg. Okay, then we're gonna do the same on the other side, the exact same move, but just a mirror image of it. And sorry for my hand being in the way of the game. So this is what you're left with. So we've got, uh, we cleared out the front and then we moved uh, to the sides. Okay, now what you wanna do, and this is a very, very critical part, is you wanna take this back middle piece and you wanna start moving it around the board. So you're gonna play this piece a couple of times. So you're gonna hop this guy and put it here. And you're gonna take this one, okay? And you're gonna stay with this piece and you're gonna jump this guy and move it to the front, okay? You're not done with him yet. You're going to take him again, and you're gonna hop him over and put him right there and take this piece, okay? Now, what you wanna do is, hmm. <laughs> I think what you wanna do here is Take this piece and jump it here, okay? And then take this one out, okay? And then what you wanna do is, oh boy, um, okay, this is not looking good. Take this, oh man, I goofed. Eventually. All right, let's try again. Like I was saying, you can win the old fashioned peg game every single time you go to Cracker Barrel and you play your friends. So, okay, this is how it's supposed to look when you start. You want the hole here in the front and we wanna make, uh, we wanna get rid of these two pegs first. So we're gonna move this guy here, okay? And take this one, okay? And then we're going to move this piece over right there and take this one and then move this piece right there and take out that. Okay, so now you're left with that. Okay, you have a little diamond shape there in the front. Now you move to the sides. You can start with either one. So you can take this peg here and move it here, take out him, and then you take this, you do it on the other side, same place, and you take that peg right there. Okay, so now you want to uh, take this center peg, okay? And you wanna start moving it around and jumping all of these guys, okay? So you're taking it from there and you're gonna put it here, okay? Take that one and then you're gonna take this one and put it here, take that one. Now you're gonna take this one and jump this one right here, okay? Whoops, okay? And now what you want to do, this is the part where I messed up last time, is you want to take this guy or this guy and jump because those are your, really your only moves other than this one, but you don't want to touch this one. So you want to take uh, this side here and put it here, okay? And take that, okay? Then you want to take this guy, oh, please be right, did you hear my stomach? And move it there, okay, yeah. And then this one jumps there and you take that one and you can see the finish line right there. And you take that one 
and then this one jumps there and you have just achieved genius status. There you go. That is how you beat the peg game every single time. Try it out tonight and thank you for watching.